All right, we're finally doing the tank upgrade. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and get some not shitty angles. We'll see how well that works out. Uh, I've I've had oh my god, don't look at that. <laughs> I've had these for like two months now, just sitting here. Uh, this I got another bag that's like off brand because this one was twenty four bucks and it's, it's like a foot tall. I don't know how much. Uh, and I got, uh, I don't think I got enough sand, so we're going to try and <laughs> see how well this works out. So this is what we got so far. I don't want any of the, the black uh, substrate to be visible. This is just for the plants. I'm really kind of going for this sand aesthetic. So put a little bit of a dummy there at first. So I put this in. I was trying to build up a border of uh, sand around so you just couldn't, so you couldn't see it from down here. So um, I still got a little bit of sand left. I was 
yeah, I was actually surprised how, how much was actually in here. So, I don't actually think I'll need the uh, second bag of of this stuff. Because I don't think I want it to be too, too high. Just, you know, higher in the front. I, mean, nah, I guess it doesn't make sense. Higher in the back. And we're figuring out as we go along. I'm not going to lie. I'm not a professional at this whole fish tank thing. Um, so, yeah. Yeah, we're going to try and time lapse this. I'm going to try and do some more editing, bro. I'm going to try and figure this out. Which I have not been doing so far, so you're gonna have to forgive me. Alright, so I got all the sand in. I'm gonna go ahead and smooth it out, and then we'll start adding with the, uh, the plants and then the hardscape, and we'll see how that goes. Okay, so right now you're in the fish tank. I'm upside down, my hair's all in the fish tank. I couldn't figure out how to uh, get the angle right for this. It's probably going to look really bad. So, bear with me. And excuse the reflection. I, I look terrible in this room. It's kind of a mess. But I figured this would be best for putting, getting the plants in. We'll see. Okay, so I messed up. Uh, I did not get enough sand like I said I did uh, these do not go deep enough and it's a bit of a, kind of a shame because really, I got some of this uh, like curly bamboo along with the straight bamboo and I thought it'd be cool to have it like bending underwater but uh, it's it's too top heavy so uh, you know whoopsie and if the top half dies then you know no big deal as long as I got this little bamboo forest going I'm cool with it so I'm gonna put these in, chop them off, and uh, get back to you. I got a lot of a lot of uh, chopping to do. I got like 20 of these. I wanted the whole back half to be like a bamboo forest. In the front, I was gonna put some smaller, like grassy plants. We'll see how this goes. Um, I think I, <laughs> I think I did the same thing I did with the last tank, which not realizing how big this one is or how small it is, and how, you know, I wanted to do too much with too little, so. It's been we'll like see. three weeks since the last clip. Uh, my voice is gone. I'm a little sick. But we got this stuff and more sand and uh, a, a turtle heater. That's the only kind of fish tank heater they had. So we should be able to get everything done today. And that's the rest of my supplies. So hopefully we'll get done today. And if we don't, I don't know what I'll do. I'll be really sad. And I just might throw this shit away in a fit of autistic rage. Right, so I got all the bamboo cuts. And I tried to lay it out, see which one's tallest, and I'll put those in the back. And the kind of like fatter spiral ones like that are kind of cool. I don't know if I'll put them in the front or the back. or kind of have them in their own like little section. <coughs> Excuse me. And then I got the little baby ones too. I'll probably put somewhere else. But uh, Let's get started. Yeah, let's yeah, this is looking a little nicer than I thought it was going to be. And uh, it's actually not as hard as I thought it was gonna be because I got this, uh, the new stuff. This stuff is like gravel, so it's a bunch of like little rocks and like the the little dissolving BBs of the last one. And it's uh, it's going through pretty easy. And uh, I know some of you might think this looks stupid, like with the light coming up, but I'm kind of planning on having this be like the whole back be covered in like the rest of this bamboo and have it be like a dark jungle forest kind of thing. And then I'll fill in the rocks up here and maybe get some like grass eventually here. But right now I think I'm just gonna do bamboo and then the hardscape. <clears throat> Man, can you can you really tell I'm not on my A game today? <laughs> Alright, so I got all the actual the actual uh, tops in. I'm starting to put these little cut ones in. Cause I cut them in half because they were real tall. I left two and weren't cut. But um it's starting to come along kind of nice. I'm going to try and fill in some of the gaps like uh, like in there with some of these just stock ones. And I think I'm going to try and lean them a little bit. So once they do grow back, they'll kind of grow like out and up a little bit at like an angle. Kind of like cover it with the leaves. I think that'd be cool if that does happen. But we'll see. We'll see how this okay, goes. So if you ever <laughs> buy one of these, uh, don't try and pull it out. All this shit is... <laughs> What's in here? It just exploded on me when I tried to pull this out. It's like a bunch of gel. Like a little goopy gel. And it just exploded on me. So don't do that. Alright, this is what it looks like so far. Uh, it, I think it's not too, too bad. 
Let me give you a little inside the tank tour. Check that out, huh? Let me zoom you out. I don't know if that looks good or not. Yeah, I think it looks kind of nice. I think once those start to grow more like this way, it'll be a little nicer. But uh, this is just the bamboo. I'm going to start on the rocks and maybe the wood. I kind of, I got this stuff because I kind of, I thought it looked like a little like dead tree. And I was going with like the forest look and this kind of looked like a tree too. But I think I might skip out on the wood because there's so much bamboo. And uh, just make, I'm going to try to make like kind of like a little cave thing with these rocks because they all kind of, that uh, looks a little dirty. Uh, they all kind of, I'll show you. Hold on, one second. They all kind of curve, so I thought if I kind of put them together like that, it could look like a little cave, you know. And there's a bunch of them like that, so this is we'll the see. rock setup so far. Kind of looks like a rib cage kind of look. That's kind of what I was kind of going for a little bit. That one kind of got a little messed up, so you can't really see all the way through. Uh, maybe I flip you around and you can see into there a little easier. I'll go to the other side. Hold on. Can you see through? No. A little bit. It's kind of cool. I mean, it's pretty plain Jane, but I like it so far. Here's what it looks like with the wood added. I think I'm going to take it out. I don't think I really like it too much. I don't think it really fits with the rest of it, so. And I didn't add the rest of the rocks. I think that's enough. And then, and that kind of like right here where my finger's going. I think I'll put some grass, because the tank is actually on the other side of the room. Uh, <clears throat> it's not much to see, it's just a little nano tank I made like two videos on. So I think once they go in here, they'll be a lot cooler. And there's still some grass and stuff in that last one, so I think I'll swap some of that over and then add some more. Just because the room's so much bigger, but I think it looks pretty cool so far. A nice little top-down view. Oh yeah, that's way cooler looking. Let me get this out of here. Yeah, I think it looks better without the little tree for another project, I guess. But here's what it looks like so far. I think it's kind of cool looking. Okay, this is basically the end of the video. So, closing notes, I guess. Don't do what I did. I was really, really dumb. And I spent way, way, way too much on this. So, uh, just look for the cheapest stuff, really, when it comes to, like, materials like sand and, like, the plants and stuff like that. I spent way, way, way too much. So, just, uh, look for a better deal than I did, I guess. I really got gypped, so... Uh, I guess stay tuned for the update with the fish and the shrimp and plants and stuff.